Yeah, so I'm from Louisiana. I'm from just outside of Baton Rouge. I didn't start playing football seriously until around my sophomore year of high school. I think he's got it down to the three, if I'm not mistaken. <laughs> I mean, it's been a ride. It's been a ride, and I enjoyed it. And it's like, it's a wonderful process to go through. And I feel so blessed and honored, and I just thank God, and I thank my family. Everyone out here who came to support me, I just thank all of you, and I appreciate it. Sign of Day is here, and I decided that I will be taking my talents to Stanford. Going to the Combine is going to be incredible. I grew up watching the Combine. You know, you watch all those guys compete and perform. Jeff motion with Burnett. And he is tackled for a loss by Justin Reed. Tremendous player is Justin Reed. And I'm just excited in my own personal sense to go to destroy these negative perceptions that some of these scouts have about Justin me. Justin Reed has been making plays on the ball all afternoon. Whenever you watch my tape, you pay attention to the whole game, you'll see what I can do and what I'm capable of. He reads this, he maintains outside leverage. Perfect execution. It's going to be nice to put that to sleep whenever I get to go up to Indianapolis. It was a real hard decision to forego my senior year and declare for the NFL draft just because I knew I'd miss the guys. I had a lot of conversations with people and Coach Shaw knew I was ready based on my athleticism mentally, physically. And Justin Reed separates ball from man, very nice. And on top of that, my brother was another big influence following me, watching the year that I had. He understood where I was at and that I'd be able to fall right into the system. Yo, yo. What's going on, man? Right. Right. How, How you, you feeling? Yeah. You good? Yeah, I'm feeling great. Right. It's a few days out before Justin Reed flies out to Indianapolis for the NFL Combine. Wanted to really go over the board work with him, really simulate some situations where scouts or coaches may pull him into the meeting rooms and want to see how well he can articulate himself, take control of the room, and, and diagram and talk responsibilities, alignments, and assignments. Okay, so I need you to draw up a 21 personnel and give me an overfront. Quarterback, fullback, halfback. So I'm gonna have my three technique lined up on the guard this way. What's gonna set me apart is the mental side of the game. I mean, knowing defenses and offensive philosophy is my strength. Then what he's doing is he's getting hands on to buy the safety sometime. These two corners, the corner and the safety, are both playing quarters technique. What are you thinking right now? He's running down the seam. Inside third. Talk to me here, at this position as you locate the ball. What can we do better here? To prepare for this combine, I work out twice a day, six days a week. I train at a place called Exos. So I have a phenomenal DB coach that comes out to coach me named Matt Clark. We go through the combine drills every day, working on footwork, working on I drive, staying low, getting out of breaks well. So I'm feeling physically great. I feel primed and ready to go. Justin Reed, uh, I mean, fantastic player. He's uh, super coachable. One straight, of those versatile straight, straight safeties that can kind of do it all on the back end. Ball. Superb ball skills. One big trait that I love about Justin Reed um, in regards to his transition to the next level is just his high tolerance of wanting to continually learn. Man, I gotta say, Justin Reed is a, he's a rare breed. The kid does everything right. Say you ask him to do something, 10 out of 10 times, he's gonna do it right. I believe that I am one of the best safeties. Justin Reed, we talked earlier about what he's meant to this defense. Just so versatile. I mean, you'll see him playing as a nickel. You see him up in run support. They blitz him. He plays man. If you don't believe in yourself, then nobody else will believe in you. The team that drafts me is going to get a leader, going to get a guy who has good character, a guy who does things the right way, a guy who doesn't cut corners, who doesn't make excuses, and a guy who wants to be there on the field and who wants to play. I mean, I don't play for money. I don't play for fame. I play because I love to play football.
Justin Reed of Stanford. Brother of Eric Reed. Yep. 444. Four, four. Go ahead, Charles. Lion. Go ahead, Charles. <laughs> That's Lion. When I think about Stanford, I think about Richard Sherman. It's, it's so funny. Yep. I can't wait to see how it plays out for him as well. For, for a big guy, he's an easy mover. He can drop down on a slot, cover a tight end, and he'll knock you on the Yes, he will. <laughs>